the party in the party is a bit of a disaster. Yeah. What's the best party you've ever been to in your life? <laughs> oh man, I've been to a lot of parties. Um, <laughs> um, I, I guess the best, I think the best parties are the ones that aren't, aren't planned, aren't they? The ones that just happen. They're like spontaneous and all of a sudden you're, you're, you know, you're with great people and you're in a great spot and it just, it's happened. It's, I tend, the ones that tend to be over planned and over thought out tend to be a bit rubbish. Yeah. So I think it's the ones that oh, you'll end up having a party on a Tuesday night for no reason. You don't get to use your own accent in films much. Was that a nice change? Uh, it was actually. Well, we, when Sally sent me the script, um, I read it and we talked about it and uh, I was like, I think you should be Irish. And then she said, you yeah, know, I, th I, I was thinking the same. Um, because it adds the very subtle sort of uh, outsider thing um, added to his already sort of outsider status of being sort of uh, this, you know, financial dude in a, in a room full of kind of intellectuals. Um, so yeah, and, and I, I, as an Irish person who lived in London for a long time, I know that very sort of, it's a very subtle thing, but you are, you are an immigrant. Next month it'll be 15 years since 28 Days Later came out. Really? Wow. Has it stood the test of time? I mean, I haven't, I haven't seen it recently, <laughs> so I don't know. That's, that's for you guys to say, isn't it? Have you missed working with zombies? Have I missed working? I can't. I haven't. No. Uh, that was... It was a brilliant experience making that film. You know, it was a really kind of game changer for me. Um, working with Danny Boyle and working with Alex Garland. And, um, and the film did so well, you know. And, and, and I do see... I don't really watch zombie stuff but we were the first people to make zombies run you know and yeah. changed everything um so yeah it's a very special place in my heart that movie what can we expect from the new series of peaky blinders uh i think i i i think there'll be a lot of surprises i think people will be very surprised by the twists and turns that it takes um you know what, what's always been great about the show is that it's brilliant writing that's its strength above all you know and then it's just our job to kind of give the writing the production it deserves. and um, So that's always been my uh, sort of impulse is to, to kind of do justice to the writing.